Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing the Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. It looks like you got the Nine of Cups and the king of swords so because you were strategic about going after something aquarius you may get what you want what you've been wishing and hoping for if this is a person uh then it looks like you'll get opportunity with this person to have better times fun times you got the ten of cups now all right so let's see so what comes up comes out it could be love and romance it could be career and finance aquarius so let's see aquarius Aquarius the queen of pentacles very nice so it seems as if you know Aquarius you're the queen of pentacles um you're focus on yourself focus on tangible things you know maybe even bring it in more money for yourself different stream of income your body how you look uh, maybe even working out um, your home you know the level of luxury you would like to have for yourself and maybe even children some of you could be a working parent working mother working father some of you focus on growth i'm hearing like growth of your hair growth maybe even of your business just growth period um this is a very lucky time for you Aquarius. it's a very fertile time so this is a time for you to start to plant an implantation or what is that yeah so this is the time for you to put seeds in the ground to grow something, okay? This is a time for you to, uh, because it's a very fertile time for you. This is also could be that some of you are going into maybe having a more serious uh, romantic connection, maybe a more serious relationship, could even go to marriage. Some of you are making very good investments with your money or you're just being better with money here with the queen of pentacles some of you are really understanding your worth like seriously understanding your worth and understanding that you are a really good catch you know maybe there's a situation that had you question yourself kind of shook you just a bit maybe you weren't chosen or somebody played you or played games with you Let's see what's going on for the Aquarius. Yeah, the Page of Swords. So um, that is an Aquarius card, one to 11 days. I don't know, you got a yes answer in one to 11 days. Maybe about some money matters, some business matters. <clears throat> there could be quiet, it could be quiet right now. No communication or very little communication or someone doesn't communicate with you as much as you do them or vice versa. It's like somebody's trying to refrain from having a heavy argument, a, a, a blow up with you or a blowout. Somebody feels like there is someone who is tactless, tasteless, careless, rude, harsh with their words. And they don't know how to maybe govern themselves accordingly when it comes to speech. Somebody feels like somebody is immature in how they, um, how they talk, how they, express themselves, how they articulate. Somebody is learning, maybe even trying to figure out how you're making money, Aquarius, how, you, how you're how you sustaining yourself. You have the Ace of Cups here. Somebody's trying to figure out how you all of a sudden can make a move or make some big move or how all of a sudden you can get a new home or somebody's really trying to figure you out here. Somebody's also trying to um, figure out if they want to restart a connection, if they want this to have resurgence. So anyway, uh, yeah, they're trying to look over it because they, they kind of got to a place of emotionally checking out, maybe even healing. And right now they just feel like the decision to allow you back or you allow them back is still up in the air. Somebody's gonna make a head over heart decision it looks like it's a yes answer, but not right now. Somebody also wants to see growth, consistency in how you fare, how you how you act or react. Somebody is really not over something. Somebody is really trying to act as if they are, but they're not. There's a 
somebody is um, hot and bothered right now. Somebody's really frisky. Somebody wants to get busy. Yeah, somebody wants to get busy. This could be a soulmate here. Somebody is just resolving to the fact that we're just not talking right now. But I'm still spying on you, asking about you, talking about you. So you've got an you got a situation this week, Aquarius, where somebody's just not ready. It might not be the right time, maybe to communicate or to push something forward. Somebody is just still not over something. Somebody feels like they were taken for granted. Somebody feels like all of a sudden this could blow up. This could go bad. This could be horrible. Um, this could be burdensome. This could be toxic. Therefore, they haven't made a decision about you or vice versa. This is you. You haven't made a decision about this person coming back. Could be dealing with a Scorpio, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Capricorn, Aquarius like yourself, Gemini, Scorpio coming up again. So you could be dealing with anybody, but it just seems as if, as if there is friction between you and someone else in the relationship. So somebody is just maintaining their distance or maintaining not talking to you as much. I don't know if you know that maybe somebody is really, really hurt. You know, maybe they haven't let on to the fact that they're really hurt. Maybe they don't feel vulnerable enough to say that they're hurt about something, that they're devastated, that they can't, there, there's an inability to cope with maybe some things that were said. These are words. It could even be an action taken. Somebody just feels like they were, that was the final nail in the coffin. It was backstabbing. It was betrayal. It was all of these things. Let's leave Aquarius with some advice for this week. What's the advice for Aquarius this week? What's the advice? The eight of wands. Woo. So keep knocking at this door, Aquarius. Obstacles will be removed. Um, communicate your intentions effectively. Okay. Um, eight of swords um, you might have to wait for a, a response or you might be kind of all tied up in knots or vice versa so this is what somebody else will do or is doing um, wow but the sun card here looks like you, you're going to get what you want here things will turn for the better they'll be more positive just hang in there hold on yeah wow Six of Cups in the in the Sun card. Things will get better between you and someone else. You and a friend, you and a lover, you and a soulmate, you and someone that you have known. Yeah, there will be reconciliation. Somebody's going to decide on you um, or vice versa. You're going to decide on someone. It just seems as if someone needs time. Either you, Aquarius, or the other person. But somebody needs time. Somebody's just like, look, I just can't make this decision off the cuff. And it seems as if somebody wants someone to make a snap decision. Say yes, say no. And someone is like, look, I, I can't do it. You know, my emotions are all over the place. I just got to a place of healing. So I would like to keep this decision up in the air for right now because I feel like I need to make some head over heart decision. I feel like I need to be strategic. I feel like I need to close off my heart or my heart is closed off. I feel like I need to see consistency growth so that we can go to the next level so that we can finish what we started with the seven of pentacles. But right now I'm just gonna spy on you and look at you and maybe even ask around about you or act as if I don't have all of these reservations, all of these emotions about you. But I do, I love you, I wanna be with you, but just not right now for whatever reason. I don't know what happened, you know what happened Aquarius. Let me know what happened down in the comment section. Bring my life a little spice, okay? So let me know what happened uh, in your, if it resonates for you in your situation. Write down in the comment section what happened, who did what, who shot John, I don't know. Um, if it resonates, do like, share, comment, subscribe. Go over to the website, book your own reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the Buy Ella Coffee link. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time where you can come and ask questions. You can also just come for the collective reading. Thank you, Aquarius. Many blessings to you. Take care.